Welcome everyone to my first ever live stream. Super stoked that any of you are actually giving me your time on this lovely Friday morning. 1,400 of them. I know that there, yeah, there's already 1,400 people in this. There was like um, 200. And I gotta be honest, we are extremely grateful for Amazing. every single one of you because you could be doing, you could be sleeping. You could be doing you so could, many other things. You could be mending those better. hangovers. You could be getting over that turkey coma. You could still be in a turkey you could coma. Be, you could be still eating turkey in that turkey coma. This chat is absolutely unbelievable. So <laughs> we already had a bunch of people super oh, chatting. Man. It's um, flying by. And, it's, and it's, it's, it's insane. I don't know how like real live streaming YouTubers do this, but a um, couple things we just wanted to dive into immediately. One, we've got brand new merchandise available for Black Friday alone. We've got the stealth shirt here. Um, oh, this camera. Oh, no, 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 this, no, 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 no. All right. Yes. First time, bear with us. The brand new stealth shirt here is available um, on our Bunker Branding shirt or website. Um, the link is pinned up at the top of the screen. 20 bucks today only. You can get it all weekend long, but save $5 today. Available only through Monday night. Uh, that's our first thing. Second, brand new squirrely merchandise available for you guys. And Sam is gonna model that for you with his very masculine physique. That's right. We modeled the squirrel after Sam. So, one, freedom first. Two, what was two? Uh, bald eagles love it. Bald eagles, yeah, yes. It looks like yeah. Sam. The ink it is, looks like me. The ink it's is red, white, and blue. The ink is made with bald eagles. What else eagles do you need to know? It's awesome. Winning. Buy it. Yeah, so another great shirt design. And then we've got a few other things here to bring on. So, holiday merch. Do, 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 do. Boom. You know you guys have your uh, aunt and uncle or... I guess your dad and your uncle that wear the same terrible shirt every year to the holidays. And they think it's funny every this time. This can be that shirt for the rest of your life. Because <laughs> it will be mine. <laughs> so, got shirt. this awesome Get Squirrely uh, holiday merch. And then we got two killer exclusive um, holiday pieces here. We've got the Candy Cane Yens and then the... Oh. Gingerbread ass clown shirt. I think this one, th I, this is great. That one's so good. So this might be the best. Ben put a bunch of time and effort into these, um, and we are, <laughs> we're loving them. I think they came out sweet. It's not something we typically do. Let me make sure we're holding these things up so you can see them. And then boom, we've center? got this guy. Okay, we're on the center. center. Add a baby. Bam. So absolutely um, ecstatic. I think is the word for all this stuff. It's now, exciting. reason we're on this live stream is not just to you know, show you all of our cute new designs. I, it's because we're giving away a bunch of stuff. I did hear they like free stuff on this. Yes, <laughs> we heard you guys like new stuff. So we've got a bunch of stuff to give away here. Um, first and foremost, I, uh, I was feeling gracious this morning and went and snagged up about uh, $500 in random gift cards we're gonna be sending out, sending out to random people who catch our attention in the chat. Um, and, or, Maybe if you're buying merch or whatever you're doing, uh, you might just happen to get a gift card in your package. Be awesome so, win stuff. Yeah, crush that link, snag some merch up. We've also got some killer other stuff here. So um, I'll announce kind of when I think I wanna drop one of these, but we've got two number four block planes um, from Wood River. We've got a, uh, excuse me, two number four hand planes, two number four block planes, two hand saws, and a six piece set of chisels. All yes. the woodworking tools. Everything All the woodworking tools. Awesome. So if you're new to woodworking and you want to, I don't know, be awesome. Even if you're you not new, I mean, who doesn't need more things? True. You're right. You're right. Everyone loves free stuff. We've also got Out. some shop rags that I'm autographing. Do, 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 do. So you can take this and, you know, blow your nose in it or wipe off your greasy hands and be awesome. Um, what about them spectacles on your face? Should we give true. those away? We're going to give away a bunch of these. But the first hundred people to buy our Punch Today in the Face hoodie will receive a shop rag signed by yours truly to do whatever you want with. Um, so we've got that going on the website right now, which is pretty awesome. Um, and yeah, so all in all, a ton of really, really cool, fun stuff going on today. We're going to be talking about some of our favorite projects and then talking about um, some of the debacles that happened to happen this year. The good, the bad, the ugly. Absolutely insane. All right. So Dustin just hit us with an ama a super chat for $25. Dustin, you, my friend, are amazing. And because of that, you will receive this block plane. Thank you, my friend. Woo! Yeah! 
So really appreciate the super chat. And like I said, if you get my attention, I'm probably going to try to give you something because we're feeling super gracious today. So Jordan, uh, Jordan you, you literally had one job today and you just missed it because you were taking a leak. But Dustin <laughs> Underwood just won the low angle block plane for hitting us with an absolutely insane super chat. Really, really appreciate that, Dustin. Um, you are the man. Now, next thing is we want to give away, what do we want to give away here? Give away, give away a gift card. Give away a gift card. Now yeah, the gift card is just going to kind of go to, um, all right. So there was a song and a video that I did this year. I don't remember what it was. Video. Uh, which video it was. But if you're watching my stuff, I was standing in this part of the shop and I was humming something to myself. I asked you in the video to respond um, to, excuse me, to tell me what song you think I was singing. You'll probably remember it now. We've done that a couple of times now. I don't, I don't remember. All right. If you know the name of that song and you put it in the chat right now, I'll give you this $25 Visa gift card. Ooh. Yep. All right, Charles got it. Charles McBride with House Fire. Yes, Charles. Yes. See, that's, that's what right. I'm talking about. You. <laughs> I don't even remember the name of the. the that's yes, right. that rules. Now All I right, remember. so Charles, you are a rock star. Uh, I I cannot believe you would remember that. By <laughs> no, it wasn't Friday by Rebecca Black. <laughs> but <laughs> it is Friday yeah, now. Rebecca Black is all over TikTok, and I think is it's she? the funniest thing. Uh, yeah, I get oh, served for stuff this. all the time, which is absolutely amazing. Seth Melnick, what's up, dude? Seth, Seth is a good friend of mine. Oh, the super glad, chats are flying. Glad to see here. So super sure super these. chats are pummeling in. Thank you, Nicholas. My goodness, Riley, you are amazing. Jamie, oh, this is unbelievable, unbelievable. So merch sales are absolutely Great. soaring in right now. So I'm gonna give something away. Something away to uh, next person to buy this shirt that I'm wearing that comes in on my stream, Ooh. you're gonna get a gift. And it's just a randomly gonna show up at your house. Um, I'm not gonna tell you who you are though. So, that was a, one of my favorite People songs. People are excited on the Joe Diffie. The Joe Diffie Friday. I, I'm not sure if they're guessing We can't play Joe Diffie during the stream because we will lose monetization. But it but, is Friday, but don't it's, worry. It's, it's always in our minds. It is always in our minds. The Christmas shirt, oh sweet. So Ben, take a note. Next stealth t-shirt sale to come in, we're throwing in, I'll secretly tell you on the side. I'll text you. I'll text you. Ooh, secret, in. secret. Got it. Awesome. Congratulations. To yeah, so congratulations to someone. Randomly. I know you guys are, everyone loves a random gift, right? It's, so I can't like, I, you know, I can do, I can do some other stuff, so. All right. So a few other things we've got going on in here is we're giving away a Pit Boss Grill on the back end of the show, as well as if you didn't watch the video we put out this week, you can literally win that table at the end of the show. That's right. And that's probably going to go to someone who's being, who's being top awesome, top level awesome. The toppest of awesome. The toppest of awesomeness. Um, we have gone squirrely, yes. So you got to, if you want to actually, the big prizes are coming on the back end of the show. You guys know we're signed up here for a few hours. I'm already like, I'm, how much coffee have you? I'm had sweating. Today? This is, I think, my fourth or fifth cup. I worry about you. I'm not going to sleep until the end of Cyber Monday when you guys are done here. <laughs> That's not healthy, John. You should yes. sleep. You're probably right. You're probably right. All right. So I want you guys to stop just uh, crushing these comments that or just being, they're so good. Let's, let's get some questions because a lot of the things we like to do on our chats, if you've ever hopped on Instagram or something else, is help you guys get through some of the tough stuff you're going through in your own woodworking. And um, yeah, so love to win a tool from you. Uh, I, I love you too. Uh, thank you. All right, Bailey, what's, what's Bailey saying here? Hey, da -da 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 -da. grew up outside of Harrisburg. Go Steez, yes, yes. Love it, Bailey. Love the Steez. All right. I hope you guys all had an amazing Thanksgiving as well. Gavin Davis. I, the effort you just put into all of those squirrel emojis, that's what I'm talking about. Write down Gavin Davis, Jordan. Okay. You're getting something for it. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm saying. I've never seen a squirrel emoji. I didn't know that was an option. I didn't either. I didn't either. All right. Do, 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 do. Joining without a joiner. Joining without a joiner. So what is Sam drinking? Sam, what are you drinking? Um... It's, it's gasoline. Kill, yes, gasoline. Now I'm drinking a Kill Cliff Recovery. You know, trying to work off all the uh, the turkey that I smoked yesterday. No energy, just just some vitamins, water, a little flavor. You know, just trying to be healthy. 
Yes. All right. So Nick DeSalvo just asked how to flatten a cookie. Um, cut on you know, how to flatten a cookie. Sorry. These are, they, they don't stay there. Um, that has some serious end grain. All right. One, I absolutely hate cookies, but two, you're going to need to use a router sled setup. If you guys have seen a bunch of our content, we use a router sled all the time. Um, and with that, you're going to need to be using a surfacing bit. Get a, that's like a two inch wide bit. Make sure that thing is brand new and then just take as light of passes as you possibly can. It should help you to be able to uh, bypass a lot of the issues that come from being with using end grain. Yeah. Um, and then you want to make sure you sand that thing. When you're, when you're doing the end grain stuff, you want to sand it really, really well. You don't want to just stop at like 120 and, you know, put a little effort in it. You want to make sure you sand that really good or else you're never going to get all that, all that tear out. So sharp blades and sanding. Yes, sharp. Yeah, and the sanding on end grain it typically takes a lot longer because the end grain is harder. Um, but it's, uh, it's something that can look truly beautiful. It's just like a cutting board. So uh, that's, that's a great question there. Uh, really appreciate it. Got these, these super chats coming in. Look at all these squirrels. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Right now for the shirt off your back signed. Hundred. Wow. Wow. So I will sign this shirt. Should we get a bidding war going? That's not a bad idea. The home woodworker, take a, the home woodworker, shoot an email to Ben at John We'll get you one. But if anyone else wants an autographed <laughs> shirt off my back, I will. Wait, they want that one. He's given a hundred bucks for this one. You don't want You can that start one. a bidding war. At the end of the stream, we'll take the highest bidder and you can get something awesome. So, all right. Boy, this, this is, you guys got to bear we with me. We're brand chats, new to we're this. We're going to miss them all. We're missing the super chats. All right. I don't know. Can you? Music Man 320, you're a rock star. Ben Heinrich, you are the man. Jason D, thank you so much. Melissa Ladon. Melissa Ladon, are we related? My, my grandparents are Ladons. Are we related? That's amazing. That's Thank you. There. William Barbie with a $24.99 super chat. That's what I'm talking about, William. <laughs> yes. All right. Can you turn a wood shop sawdust into pallets for a pit, pellets for a pit boss? That would be amazing, Andy. One, thank you for your donation. But two, I would avoid We're have that. To look into that. Our stuff's it. all over the place. So we've got another super chat. I want to send thank you out to Adam Hoover. Adam, you are incredible. Uh, Army Vet, thank, thank you for you. your service. Thank you for your um, Side money with woodworking. I love that hustle. And I love that you love our content. Um, and I'm glad that you like the epoxy stuff and the epoxy tips. We're trying to work on some getting some more stuff like there too, um, which is great. Kevin, thank you for your super chat. I do play fantasy football. Um, it's weird that I just try to draft the whole Steelers team every year. Um, but I'm getting pummeled this year. I actually took Michael Thomas first, and that stunk. Lamar Jackson second. He's not doing anything close to what he's doing. So I traded them for Big Ben <laughs> and, another, and a couple other players. Um, but I, I don't think I'm going to make playoffs this year because I'm playing a guy that had dust, er, Deshaun Watson yesterday, and he put up four tutters. 50 bucks from Ken Johnson? My goodness, Ken. Give him something. Ken's, give this to Ken. Give this to Ken and give these to Ken. Ken Johnson, you, my friend, are unbelievable. Thank you so much. $50. $50 in the super chat. You know That's how, aggressive. Do you know how much coffee I can buy with $50? It's absolutely amazing. That's unbelievable. Like coffee. All right. So let's, uh, you got that written down, Jordan? Yes, sir. Wonderful. So you guys are amazing. I'm checking in on the merch sales right now. And uh, holy crap. <laughs> We've sold over a hundred items. A hundred? This is like today? Yeah. <laughs> or like it This is absolutely insane. A hundred people. Insane. Thank you guys. That's amazing. All right. And Derek Hampsey just bought a, uh, a stealth shirt, extra large. My, my big people. Thank you. I love that. Um, so Derek, you, my friend, are going to take home. What else do we got here? We have we... a couple Just more of these. those left. Um, we're chucking a gift card in that for you, for Derek. Thank you so much, my friend. You are an absolute rock star. I can't believe we've sold 100 items. That's amazing. Like, 100 items for us is like a half the month, typically. Um, so really appreciate you guys. All right, back to these insane super chats. Oh, geez, I'm flying in now. Oh, six, what is, six? KC South Sutherland, 60 bucks? That is, 49.99. you are the oh, best. Geez. This is, this is amazing. Chicago Casino, Keith and Bert from, OC, some, from CCS. Thank you so much. Now, I literally, I cannot, <laughs> this is, this is, this is, this is nuts. I, I don't know how we're going to keep up. I cannot keep up. 
All right, do, 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 do. finally found something you'd like to get after getting out of the Marine course. All right, so Gabriel, thank you so much, one, for your service, and two, I'm really glad to hear you're fired up to dive into woodworking when you're done with your, uh, with your service. You, my friend, are you, my friend, are like embodying what we're trying to do here uh, is bring as many, you know, fun and positive vibes as we possibly I can. I got a $100 super chat. I got a $100 super chat? I see chat. a 75. <laughs> There's a hundred. Oh, there it is. is that, no, that's ten. My goodness, no, they're coming in so fast, I can't keep Justin up. Justin Morgan. Justin Morgan. Justin Morgan. You, my friend. <laughs> Merry <laughs> Christmas. <laughs> Must have <laughs> Justin. All right, we gotta give him something. Justin, uh, send Justin a punch today in the face hoodie. Really appreciate you, Justin. You are the man. Thank you so much. All right, so like I said, the the speaking of the hoodies, we're doing a signed rag. Do we have one of the hoodies Autographed here? rag with every one of the hoodies. Jordan's wearing one. Jordan, why don't you come here? here? I knew I was going to be sweating, so I couldn't wear a hoodie. Yeah, Plus, I wanted to show off this, this sexy new stealth we're shirt, we're um, in the middle which, is, which is absolutely insane. But here, look Jordan, at that camera. We'll oh, on look at that camera. Okay. Flex. Right Stop being so tiny. Be bigger. <sighs> so yeah, we got the punch today in the face hoodie coming with a rag. Um, and we're running that through the end of the, the weekend. There you go. Oh, nice. Nice. That's yeah. a little delay there. Um, yeah, so don't forget to grab that up. That's like an exclusive offer. I put a bunch of time into signing that stuff, um, and I and I <laughs> and I loved it. The first hundred orders of that hoodie get a get one of those rags. Super comfy, dude. Justin, you are. I cannot Secret believe Thanks. someone gave us go that right much down money. Down okay. Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely amazing. Too, if we miss stuff. Amazing. So we gotta cruise through some of these super chat questions. Yeah, we we do. All right, we can't super, ignore these people. super chat questions. Okay. All right, they're just all, they're just all gratitude because they're such amazing people. Because you got back into woodworking, I love it. Get Getting squirrely, squirrely in PA. Yeah. Stacy Lang up? with seventy five dollars. Oh yes, PA in the house. Oh, they're dropping off. Thank you for the military I support. No, thank you guys for serving. All right, you and your son enjoy the clownery. I'm so glad to hear that. I, we we can't. I cannot believe how many people watch their stuff with their family. Because like we for a long time thought we weren't very family friendly. But it concerns me a little even still. But it's but it's but it's, it's, it's been that. a blast. Like the this is for the clownery. Thank you so much, Robbie Harper. You rock. All right, you don't have much, but we appreciate it. John, we appreciate you. And because of your, you don't have much and you're still given, you're the type of person that we appreciate the most. Bam. Thank you so much, John. John, Give romantic me. kiss. Jordan, write that down. You gotta be able to throw in you a gift card, my friend, and a shop rag. You got that noted, Jordan? Yes, I just need verbal confirmation when I say something, just in case. <laughs> I can't see you, boss. In case you're asleep in your mashed potatoes. Over. Happy 262nd <laughs> birthday, Pittsburgh. Wow, it's Pittsburgh's birthday? Wait, is that today? Is that real? Once a moose. Is that real? If I could go back in time, one thing that I could have learned earlier. Um, well, when it comes to woodworking and like building things specifically, if I could have learned anything earlier, it would be put more time into planning. Since yes. we've gotten much better at planning our projects, we hit a lot less speed bumps and it really helps us be good. If it could have been anything in life, it would have been put more time and effort in working out all the way through the year for my NFL career. Because it was it became like really difficult after you know certain so many years doing it to be as consistent on a day-to-day -day basis in the offseason and during the season. Um, I, I wish I would have taken that a little more serious. But you know, what is it you say now? Like being an athlete is a full-time job or yeah, being an athlete's a full-time job. Yeah. All right, so send your hubby Amos. Yeah, okay. All right, so Amos, Amos wants me to send something to his hubby, or her hubby. I can't, sorry, I can't read. and couldn't watch the live because you, you know work. Amos, shoot him an email to ben at johnmalecki.com. We'll get him something. Squirrely on Black Friday. Good, because freedom, baby. I love it, I love it, I love it. Thank you, JT Carter. Oh, we got a $50? Uh, and, and, and money vomit eyes from Rich Lang? I love money vomit eyes. <laughs> you rock, Rich. That's Thank amazing. you. Thank I feel like you. We, we need more prizes. Well, we've we got okay, a hundred euros. My goodness. Oh, how much is, is that? Like, how many? How much? How is many dollars euros? is that? We only speak. In I can't even minutes. get look at look at the ten bucks here from Augustus. I love that name. Tim Cagley, love your channel. It's how you start your day besides massive coffee before you get ready. Uh, dude, I love it. Teaching Shop your teacher. students. Thank that's you for amazing. being a teacher because I know that's not easy. Um, all right, so we're giving away a pull saw. Next person to snag up. One of our new holiday pieces of merchandise, you're getting a pull saw with it. Ben, 
We're at whew, 130 orders. My goodness, this rocks. All right. Table I'm like sitting here waiting. Living room. Sitting here waiting. Do, 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 do. When that comes in, pull saw. So these Japanese pull saws, if you guys watch me cut dovetails or we did any of our other stuff, um, it's this saw this specifically stuff. with the hard back. Um, it's one of, it's absolutely my favorite. I don't let anyone else in the shop touch it. Um, so, you know, if that, with that being said, it's, I'm she's my baby it. girl and you can have one if you buy one of these, uh, pieces of merchandise that are, uh, do one of the holiday exclusives there. So if anyone can read it, the, the label is Japanese, so I don't know what it says, but good sauce. Currently deployed. I love it. We have people overseas watching. I love it. That's Marine amazing. Corps vet. Dude, the amount of the amount of veterans, uh, we cannot thank you guys enough. A lot of people ask us, no, I never served, um, but we fly the flags in the back of our shop because they were gifts to us from uh, a few of our from friends, friends that were in uh, the service. And uh, you know, we, we hang those in support. Uh, we support all, all branches of the military and are super gracious for pretty much all of it because yeah. we couldn't do anything That's right. close to what we're doing today without the protection of our, of our servicemen and women. And we actually got a really, really awesome project coming up with the local veteran foundation you guys are gonna love. It's gonna we're be giving, a good one. We're Make giving sure away two, subscribe. we're giving away three pieces Three it's pieces for the home. Yeah, it just keeps getting better. Yes, uh, to a couple families in need that we're working with a local veteran foundation. Um, it should be a really cool video, and that'll be coming out the same week as uh, as Christmas. So we're super stoked about that. Super but thank you to all of our servicemen and women on here. So the big the big thing we're giving away. We're about twenty minutes. We're only twenty minutes in. We're twenty minutes. Oh geez. Okay. We gotta. We gotta. Relax we are firing. Through. I gotta. Fire I, I know. We're we're running out of prizes. But it looks, I mean, look at this, John. The super chat. We could almost pay. Pay for Jordan. Yeah, we could Delicious. almost pay for you guys are. This is going sh straight to Jordan, straight to Jordan. So we love it. Um, Andrew, Andrew Tomkovich, thank you. Multiple super chats from Andrew, multiple. That you know what? Send him a sweatshirt. And you, and ugly my friend, sweatshirts coming yes, your way. Yes, now get one of these. Um, so one thing we do want to talk about here is uh, the build. The build we did this week, right? You, we'll bring that up here in a bit, but. Man, did that thing kick my ass. So a lot of you <laughs> saw the content and feel really inspired by it. And I just want to talk for a second, one second, about hitting those like difficult roadblocks in life, especially in a time like this and keeping a positive attitude, right? Um, I'm a firm believer, and I know most of the team here is, in controlling what you can control. And the number one thing you can control in your life is your attitude. The way you respond to things. Exactly. Um, that project had a bunch of hiccups. We spent a bunch of money on the, uh, I mean, it was like the 2020 project. Oh, it was the it was 2020 project. Turned around, just it absolutely killing us. Um, so with that, a lot of you are going through adverse times and a lot of difficulty and stuff. And I just wanted to say, keep your head up, keep, you keep working through it. Things will get better. If you just continue to persevere and push, uh, you know, it's going to be all right. You will, you will get to the other side. Um, and, and it, keeping a positive mindset is something that I cannot attest enough, <laughs> like enough of my energy to, um, to, to help other people. And, and I really appreciate tons of amazing comments on that video from people that were like, you know, I've gotten a few emails and stuff too. There, that are this, this project was great. Cause you know, a lot of the people are up to the wire on the holidays yeah, and it was really hard. Time and yeah. I'm glad we could bring a little cheer. Yes. So uh, all of you that have watched or haven't watched, thank you. And I'm, we're pretty excited because we're giving that thing away at the end here around, around noon. We're going to pull that thing up here and uh, give you guys some time to, to, to take that. So one thing I wanted to get back to was Jason Tilly just gave us 50 bucks. Jason, you rock. And I wanted to say, get squirrely, Tillys. No 4XLs in the shop. All right, send us a DM. We'll get something fixed for you there, my friend. Um, send us an email, ben at uh, johnmalecki.com. Um, apologize for the Forex. We just don't carry that many massive sizes like that uh, because the, the inventory, you know, all kinds of stuff. And we, and we drop ship, so um, they're not actually in-house. But we'll, we'll see we'll what we can sure get done for you, done. Jason. All right. Has served in the Air Force. Thank you. Formal Slayer. Yes, thank you. Stumbled on your channel by him. Uh, what's super funny is I get a lot of servicemen and women who like watch on deployment as like teams and they're like, we were watching the clownery and all you guys being idiots and blah, blah. And it was amazing. Uh, they were like literally, um, you know, teams of people uh, watching this stuff, which, which was which was absolutely insane. And I cannot say like how, 
how how cool it is to hear that like a whole unit of people yeah, it blows uh, me away. Are, it we're, are watching our stuff together. It blows me away anyone watches this. So, you know what? Thank you, Brett S., for, for, being, for bringing positive vibes <laughs> and for your donation. Um, we try our hardest, and we, and we know these, this pandemic is really hard for a lot of people. Sherry Jewel, thank you for the donation, for the, for the super chat. Um, yeah, so, uh, you know, we've got... Oh, man. Oh, man. Where did it go? Oh, oh they're going so fast. Right, let's hop into some of these non-super chats. Oh, there's just so many super chats. We, I literally can't keep up. All right, my favorite hand planer and why from John Finch. John Finch just won with that question. John Finch is going to win a gift card. And uh, I will tell you about my favorite hand plan right here. So, oh, it's going with that one. I'm going with the big guns here. This guess. is my Lee Nielsen four and a half. Um, and it's just because it's got a little bit of a wider sole. The reason it's my favorite is it's a, it's a smoothing plan. So it's pretty um, versatile, one. And two, I got a big old hand. And this thing's nice and wide which allows my hand to get in and fit around without going over the, the sides of the planer here and stuff. Um, but it's a really good tool. I waited a few years. I didn't buy this till I could afford it because this is a, yeah, this, this plane's cool. pretty, pretty expensive. But Wood River also makes a four and a half inch plane. Do we have that one? Um, and we don't have one because their inventory's low and I, and I left it for Yin's guys to it's buy. It's kind of like this one. Instead of getting my stuff. So we've got the number four here and you can see the number four and then the four and a half. That's like a standard measurement. Uh, you can just see it's got another, uh, I would say half of an inch weird, of width on it. Um, Wait, do you mean to tell me that the numbers are how wide they are? No, they're not. I, was gonna say, the, I the, didn't know that. No, I don't think away. that's what they are. Because this one's a five, and that's, or six, and it's never close to six inches. You're right, it's just longer. But that's my favorite hand plane. Um, another I would highly suggest would be this low angle block plane. So I already gave one away to the first buyer of the Stealth shirt. Um, so since you asked, let's go, let's see how these orders are doing. Um, ooh, we're at 170 orders. 100 out. You're going to be bruised by the end of this. I apologize. When I get fired up, I just like to throw some You're out aggressive. there. Um, all right, so. Do, 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 do. Shout out to Ben, just a cop starting a side gig to decompress from the job. Appreciate you. Yeah. One of my best friends is a cop, so I understand the stress of that job. Is that a $101? Oh, my goodness. That's from Dustin. Dustin, Dustin, you rock star! Make sure, make sure we get Dustin yeah. uh, a big, a big, a big shirt. Um, all right, so we're gonna give away. It's about ten thirty. This block plane, one of these, the low angle block plane. This one to someone who purchases one of the punch today in the face hoodies in the next fifteen minutes. Um, we we get so much encouraging like information coming into us about the, the punch day in the face. Uh, talking to it a little bit, like the, the whole mindset and concept that I was like spinning on a little bit earlier here, um, you know, being able to control your, uh, your emotions and your reaction to things, is, it's super important to me. And like my whole uh, like ethos. ethos on punch today in the face came to me from like when I was playing in the NFL. So if you guys didn't know, I bounced around the NFL for about four years when I got done with college. And uh, it was the most unbelievable experience, and it was a culmination of like my entire life's journey. But with that, I got cut 13 times. I played for five different teams. I was all over the country. Um, and when you're when you're not on an active roster on game day, you actually don't get paid. <laughs> I was on practice squad. I was up on rosters. I was down. I was all over the place. Um, and it got really difficult to stay positive. Um, and I had a strength coach in college who was really big on you know, being self-aware and understanding why things happen. And punch today in the face was something he said to me once. And, and it just kind of like stuck. He's like, you're either gonna wake up and you're gonna survive or you're gonna conquer. And for myself, survive or conquer has been all I've thought since I met that man in 2007. And <clears throat> I look at every day as I have to conquer it. And so punch today in the face kind of like evolved out of that. And when I was starting the business, there was a lot of long hours a lot of really grueling days. And you can wake up in the morning and not feel you know, energized, your, your body can hurt, there can be a lot of stuff going on, and you literally can either let it beat you down or you can punch back. And so punch today in the face for us has been, and for myself, has been exactly that. Like you can wake up every single day and you can conquer what's going on. Um, and I choose every day to wake up and make sure I'm the first person to throw a blow and I don't let the, let the day hit me in the face. Um, so that the hoodie has been 
I guess, a culmination of a long time for me to come out. Like we, we haven't had punch today in the face and a lot of our merchandise and branding because it's a little bit aggressive and a lot of people don't like it. But um, we recently had, and uh, he, he might be on here, uh, a little girl, um, her name was Reagan. She, uh, she was going through some stuff at school and school's quite uh, difficult for her. And um, her dad and her watch our content. And this is like, this is the stuff that warms my heart. Because it was hard for her to get up and go to school every day, they adopted the mindset and the, and the mantra, of punch, punch today in the face. Like, Reagan, go ahead and you can punch today in the face. Um, and they reached out and told me this little story of, you know, how, how she gets up every day. Um, and they, they say, you know, punch, punch today in the face, face. together. Um, and it just, like, was really warming to see, even though it's a little bit on the aggressive side and a little bit of, you know, a, uh, uh, a violent concept. It's not that violent if you think about it in, in concept. Um, and it was just absolutely amazing to me to hear, you know, this little girl gain the courage to go to work with, with that mantra and with that ethos, not work, excuse me, go to school yeah, with that ethos and, and, and have it have a positive impact on their life. So punch today in the face for us has been, you know, absolutely amazing. So, you know, with that, I'm going to share that with you guys. You know, that's why we've got the stealth shirt on sale today. That's why we launched this, uh, you know, and, and, um, you know, just punch, punch today in the face is like, you can it matters to me. And the hoodie. You it matters to me. So can rock it twice. one of the, one of the next people, yeah, we've got about 10 more minutes. Um, anyone who buys a hoodie, you've got a, you're going to have a block plane show up at your house with that hoodie as well as maybe something else. Who knows? Maybe we'll throw some more prizes in there, but the, they're, are they saying it's sold out? I got a couple comments on there saying it's sold out. Which one sold out? So which Keith, which one's sold out? My friend shouldn't be sold out. The stealth XXL is sold out double XL. All right. We'll get some of the guys on it. A four and a half. Yeah, probably should go collar. Um, do, 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 do. All right. So we've got, oh, dude, I can't believe by the way, a lot of the young people that are on here. So I'm going to get back here, get into these super chat, these super chats. I cannot believe how many, how gracious you guys are. Jeffrey knew, excuse me, Jeffrey Newville, you are absolutely amazing. A hundred dollars. Thank you. Trying to win something for your husband. You're both big fans. Well, Sherry Drool, you did just win something. What else do we got here? Congratulations. Jordan, write that one down because your husband just won the number four block, the number four hand plan. Oh yeah. Yes. This guy. And it's actually, it's this one. So congratulations, Sherry. You are amazing and a phenomenal wife. Thank you for tuning in and taking the time today. That's and that's now, absolutely sure he, awesome. Make sure he makes you something. Do, 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 do. All right, so Gary Ross just lost his job and can't afford anything, so he guess he can't win. Nope, Gary, you did just win. Jordan, take Gary's name down. Yeah. Because Gary's getting a gift card. Oh hell yeah! Bam! Congratulations, Gary. Uh, Appreciate you. You'll get through these in. hard times. I promise, my friend. I hope you're still there. Um, We'll reach out to you if we can find you. Uh, but you know, I'm trying to get through these comments the best I can. Yeah, the, too much traffic on the website. Just refresh. <clears throat> keep, okay, so if something's saying sold out, it's just because there's a ton of traffic on the site. Um, just keep refreshing, uh, and, and you guys will have a shot there. We've got uh, probably five more minutes to snag up one of the Punch Day in the Face hoodies um, and win yourself a number four block plane here. So... Uh, do, 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 do. The Nick Offerman on our wall, man. We've been getting a ton of questions about that. Nick Probably Offerman, my favorite part of the shop. Right it is there. definitely the favorite part of the shop. Jordan, can I get a? It's actually Ben. Can I get a drink? Is, here it, when you can is it nailed to the wall, or can we pull it off? I think. I think. Uh, Let me try to. Yeah, bring him over. Bring him Ron, over. Ron needs to this. Ron, funny story. So I want to know in the chat. Thank you. Ooh, look at that. A punch today in the face koozie. We Who? Don't um, look too close to that miter, but yeah, don't look at the miter because I rushed through and I think that wood was still kind of wet. Ooh. He's a little dirty, but so Ron here is a funny story. Who's seen the video with Ron in it? Throw me, throw some chats at me if you've seen that. Do, 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 do. David, I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. Ohio Power Tool, boom, with another 1983. God, you guys are so good. I can't. Just so you know, the reason I see the super chats is because they bump, bump to the top. You have four daughters and your nine-year-old twins are starting to want to spend time in the shop. That that's is amazing, that. Scott. See, that's what we're talking about. I, uh, we didn't have a shop when I was younger, but my dad always had my hands on tools. So that's kind of where I got You're my right, affinity to like tools. It is Ron. It's not Nick. Kind of Nick. It's, it's Ron, Ron, yes. Very, very Ron. Great work, great stuff. Oh, do, 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 do. 
Stuff Sam in a box for the next different way. <laughs> I don't think my wife would be too stoked on that. Sam's also claustrophobic, but that is a phenomenal idea, Michael. Thank you so much. We got a lot of young people on here. Nice laggy. Laggy man is, uh, throw laggy man some 15. Jordan, laggy man, 15 year old. We're going to send you some of our spectacles and a shop rag. 15 year old, just getting started making knives. Um, good brands for wood files. Um, I think it is. Did the cuts all ones? Yeah, cuts all makes great files. But who made this one? I gotta remember. Something with an N. Uh, Nicholson, I think. Nicholson, right. yes, it might be Nicholson. It's a rasp file. Uh, they make all kinds of stuff. Theirs are really, really good. Um, I am drinking Black Rifle Coffee Organic Blend, Ooh. a medium roast. It's, a, it's a good coffee. One, um, one that I'm a, I'm a big fan of, um, and and. <clears throat> Uh, something that I personally really enjoy when it shows up every month because I'm in their coffee club. And we have a pretty killer project coming up with them that we're going to get started here in the next two weeks that I think you guys are going to absolutely love. It. That might be the best project. All right. Ever. So we got Kyle here saying his cousin and him recently reunited under our new shared hobbies of woodworking. I love that. And That's I awesome. love that you guys love our content. And I appreciate you snagging him up a shirt for the holidays. We're coming in here. I think we got what four minutes left. Wait, is that a bald eagle? Emoji? Ben, you got to give me a time on whenever I should. Uh, yeah. I got. We got to pick that winner. Yeah. Um. Somebody talking about pit boss smokers. Oh yeah, we got pit. So, did you do Saving Hunter? Up for a pit boss. Hunter Eldridge. I uh, grew up with some Eldridges. Did you do? Any aid I can give you? All right, Hunter. So I got a bunch of videos on like beginner stuff. Just check those out, man. Get started on some projects. We got a twelve-year-old wood turner here, Jacob. He probably uh, turns better than we do. Definitely turns better than we do. So a lot of our stuff, he enjoys the videos, a lot of fun. Uh, did, 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 one and a half and three year old are already in the shop and I love it. Yes. Um, I'm actually, so if, if you guys didn't know, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you probably don't know this because I don't put a lot of stuff on YouTube. I put on Instagram. Yeah, we have But uh, about that, yeah. I'm going to be a dad here in March. Um, and so I'm going to have a little, little girl. We're super stoked on that. Um, and uh, I'm, I'm hoping I can get her down into the shop. We just... 200 pieces of merchandise now. 200 merch. That's amazing. Oh, Give you guys, away, you guys are the absolute best. You guys are the absolute best. So, all right. Well, the 15, I think the 15 minutes are up, right, Ben? Yep. 15 minutes are up. And so punch today in the face. Kim Johannick, you just won yourself this low angle block plane. Boom. Thank you so much. That'll be coming to you probably in a separate package, depending on how fast we can get our merchandise printed for you. Our man, you. Ken's got some boob sweat going on. Ken's got boob sweat going on. Thank yeah. you, Ken. Ken Johnson, boob sweat. <laughs> Ken, it's, uh, <laughs> it's not boob sweat season here anymore, um, but it is uh, for sure uh, always boob sweat mentality around here. All right, so. Should we hit some of these super chats? They're coming in fast. They are. So let me get. Boy, this is amazing. Registered nurse here. Thank you to all the frontline workers. We know we're dealing with a pandemic here. Uh, what's super awesome is like our whole team cares so much about everyone here that everyone stayed safe during the holiday yesterday. Yeah. No, one, no one really did anything stupid or crazy. And um, we thank all you frontline workers for keeping everyone healthy um, and, and helping with all of the ridiculous things that's going on right now. So before I cut my hand on that, thank you, uh, Chris. Thank you, Charles Terrell. Alone history. History began on July 4th, 1776. Uh, Got it. All right. So a couple more things. Andrew Mason, um, your mom passed away back in June. I'm super sorry to hear that. Uh, and I'm really glad that you're, you're digging the channel uh, and, 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 uh, and, and that we can bring you some semblance of joy. Um, my family and myself are definitely staying safe, and so is the whole team here. Uh, we really, really appreciate you. Excuse me, taking time this morning, Andrew, to uh, hang out with us. We've got Jeremiah Heathco asked a question. Asked about names three times. Ooh, I have. <laughs> uh, oh, so Jeremiah, you're asked. Sorry, man, we're getting pummeled with these chats, and it's absolutely incredible. Um, if you're looking He's for. You're about to be a dad, it looks you're like. You're going to be a dad. Congratulations. <laughs> I, if I had a suggestion for a name, and you'll get this joke, John Dingo. Would definitely be my a, a first name I would choose for a little yeah. boy. Um, we do have our daughter's name picked. I think you guys are really going to like it. We'll let you know once she is born. Jake Scott, duh, 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 duh. what have you learned the most from and why? Also, what Jake project? Scott in Australia. Mm. What project have I learned the most from? I'm going to say our uh, 
One of the, 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 the black rifle coffee where we poured all the 5,000 bullets in epoxy was huge because there was a lot of moving parts there. We had huge slabs, a ton of welding. We had a bunch of epoxy, obviously. Yeah. And we were encasing something which we had never done before that. A lot um, of firsts on that project. That was a lot of firsts. And we put a lot of, we put probably like three weeks of time into planning that to make sure we didn't screw up. And that goes back to what I was saying earlier. Uh, putting the time and effort into, you know, planning really does help execute on those kind of things. Yeah, it's um, also the furthest project I think we've ever... Yeah, we delivered it to Texas, so that ruled. That was Augustus, fun. thank you, thinks we have the best channel on the market. Uh, oh my goodness. Jim, Jim. Blis Bleskowitz, sorry if I mispronounced that, just gave us $125. All right, what is Jim. we got to answer whatever he's Jim, you are here. amazing. We got All right. skills and attitude. You and your seven-year-old son love the content. Well, we love Yin's um, kid sizes and merch. We have classes. we have little kid. Yeah, we have little merch. Uh, take his name down. We'll send you something here in the mail, Jim. Thank you so much, um, and love to hear that you're getting squarely in the shop. Uh, sign hat by the team for would be amazing. You got it, my friend. Coming your way. So, a couple of the things we had docketed to talk about. I knew these questions would be coming in, and I want to get to all of them, and I apologize for missing them. Um, but we want to talk about. Couple of our favorite projects for the year, right? Yeah, let's jump into some of the, the good, the bad, the ugly. So, put that back up for me. Make sure we're, we're hitting on the right topic. So, um, I think myself personally, my favorite project this year was definitely the cave table. The cave table <clears throat> was a good one. The cave table was like a progression. So we moved from in the cave table from who else? Who else's favorite project this year was was the floating cave table? I want to know. Throw some chats in there. Um, if I if I catch notice of your chat. Uh, I'm, I might throw you a little gifty gift here. People really want to know how we know each other. <laughs> how do we know each other? That, we we'll can't, get to that. We we'll can't tell you that, that secret. Um, <laughs> but yeah, the cave table. So if you've seen the cave table, which one was it? Uh, how many? Oh my goodness. Cave that table was like my favorite. I did. I thought it was great. Very epic. One. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. My good. Mick Jagger. Don't like Mick Jagger. I'm a Zeppelin guy. Um, bald eagles and beer lines. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> yes. Seven, all right. Bald eagles and beer lines. Uh, good, good grief. Good grief. G send them a... Uh, you get a shop rag and a uh, set of glasses for that one. That's a deep <laughs> amazing. That's you got to be watching our content all the time. Um, yeah, the cave table was absolutely amazing uh, and something that I, I loved because one, I put my power carving uh, that was like one of the took first. that to the next level. Like that yeah. was the thing, the first like true project I really really did a lot of power carving on. And I think the acrylic came out absolutely amazing on the uh, on the sides and stuff to give it that like floating effect. We did have some. Uh, have some things we had to concern ourselves with as far as like that thing blowing up on us, but it's still sitting in the shop. It's, it's still together. Power carving turned out awesome. It's unique. Yeah. Uh, I think that was the first one that Be Project Ben was in. That was the first in. time Ben was on a project. Because uh, I was out fishing. Woo! -hoo! I, had, <laughs> I had better stuff to do. But yeah. definitely one of the best projects of the year. Agreed. And, and so that was my favorite. I'm glad to hear. What, what, which one would you say was your favorite? Your Senate? Oh, my favorite projects probably. Um, I'm gonna go with either the some of the, the other floating stuff I think was the best stuff we did like the tensegrity table the yes. the, the two legged chair that was kind of fun the the ten <laughs> funny thing about the tensegrity table is one it's sadly broken it's, it's sitting it over didn't here come apart almost. um the 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 strings and stuff didn't fail it was like the holding mechanism like we really did a crappy job on that one with the uh, wood we chose because I used like a soft wood for those pegs. Um, yeah, it but ended up like soft if you guys remember that, who here remembers the Tensegrity table, the first one we did? The walnut one. The one that actually went viral uh, that I'm sure a lot of you have seen. So thank you all. All of you have seen that. I think the um, best part of that project, though, was that we we saw something cool on the internet. You you called me about it. I, I did. ignored your call because I was I was you're rude or something. Yes. And neither of us really understood how it worked. And going through that process of really figuring that out. And kind of, you know, the authentic joy that we had when that thing actually, it actually worked. Yeah. Was, was probably my favorite. So, so, favorite so like, part. we don't fake stuff here. Like, if you see us, like, a lot of people just bring crazy emotion um, all the time. And, like, yeah, I'm a I'm pretty fired up guy. But that table, like, it was right here. We were, we were working on it right here. And we, we had it fall down, like, eight times. And it was really getting to be a headache. I wasn't sure we were going to do it. And it was a, uh, it was all because I'm I'm a clown and I wanted to, um, like, use the thinnest and most invisible line that I could to hang it. 
And because of that, it got tensioning in itself got, got to be really, really difficult. Um, so from, from that sake, when it got hung up, it was four o'clock on a Friday afternoon. Sam and I were wrapping up for the week and we were like, man, maybe we'll just come back this Monday. I was like, oh, let's try this one little tweak. And the excitement you uh, saw from us was truly how we felt because it was a weeks long battle trying to get that thing to, to, to hang up. Um, and it was absolutely incredible. So I, <laughs> I've just got to say that project, it was, it was the only reason it wasn't my number one most fun project was because I knew it was your number one. No, so, okay. Okay, so yeah. I wanted to be able to talk about at least two projects <laughs> on here, but that, that honestly, that project kind of like launched our channel into a new stratosphere. If you guys are new to the channel, you'll know that we've probably doubled in size since this time last year. That's why we're doing this crazy live giveaway. And, uh, this year is do, 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 do. you should do a grand prize drawing through merch join you at the shop and build something together cook food and stuff and things every day jay that is a phenomenal idea <laughs> and we'll keep that in mind for 2021 can't do that right now because we're staying pretty distant with the pandemic. baby but um yeah so neon x like we're really hoping to get to half a million subs by the end of the year it's been an amazing year of growth and it all kind of started with that that 10 segregate tables when we really started to take off um, it was a super fun project. And what's even more amazing is that there's like hundreds of people out there trying to build their own, putting them all over YouTube. They tag us and a bunch of stuff, yeah, which is, which is a awesome. Of and a ton of fun. A couple of them are probably better than what we Oh, did. yeah. You know, uh, people are out there crushing it. They're crushing it. They're absolutely crushing it. All right. So <laughs> top fan of my Facebook page. Thank you. My favorite Zeppelin song of all times from Jason Powell. So that's a phenomenal question, Jason Powell. Thank you for that. You're going to get some of these. You got that, Jordan? What's his last name? <clears throat> Jason Powell, P-O-W-E-L-L. -L. You're amazing. My favorite Zeppelin song of all time. This is a, quite the difficult question. But mm. I love, like, <sighs> it's so hard. Like, when the levee breaks, we, oh, we're big, gotta be big fans gotta of that song. Favorite. Absolutely, you know, I, I think that drum intro is so good. I know a lot of people think Hot for Teachers better. We brought that up in a video. Um, we did talk about and that. And people were like killing me because I didn't think Hot for Teacher was a better drum intro. I think what? you know the backstory of the recording of that song. And, yeah, and so John Bonham actually house. recorded that in like this crazy house and you got all this echo and stuff. So the reason it sounds, it's just amazing. Sam actually was a drummer on the drum line I in was high school. Many moons ago. So we're big fans of that drum intro. Rusty, so yeah. when the levee breaks is up there. Um, this is. It's, Thank You is a Zeppelin song. It's not one of their more popular songs, but it's, it's, one, of my, it's one of my favorites. It's, it's super emotional. I'm a big country music guy, too, because yeah. I love the emotions. When you get the emotional Right tugging, in the feels. When you get it tugging, I'm a, big, Wait, I'm, I'm a big fan of that. Is Paul in here? Someone said, hi, Paul Jackman. Is Paul watching? Or? I'm not Paul Jackman. I'm Paul Jackman's father. No, I'm actually. Are they talking to you? Or I'm actually talking Mr. Bilbit's father. <laughs> um, Evan Ireland in the super chat. Now, all right, so hold on. Yes. All right, Evan, you've been laid off since March. I apologize. I'm so sorry to hear that. Um, so, you know, one, thank you. Um, I really appreciate it that you've taken the time to not only sign in here, but to give us a couple bucks and you're going to get a hoodie, a punch in the, in the face hoodie. So thank you, thank you for that, Evan. Thank you um, for hanging out with us today. And, uh, and I'll, and I'll, yeah, with one of the signed shop rads, right? Yeah. Yep. Ben, do you Perfect. want him to email you? Or yeah, have email. Email. And email Ben at John. You can, you can say that out loud. You They're not going to get mad if they hear you. So, Evan, <laughs> email Ben at JohnMalecki.com. Let's check in on orders. 225 pieces of merch have sold today. Yeah. All right. So, we're almost at the top of the second hour. We're almost an hour into this. Yes. Hour. And we wow. have the table, the Pit Boss Grill. We have two full, full get-ups from Timberland Pro. I'm giving away a set of chinjols. We got one more block pane, and I probably got four hundred dollars left in gift. The gift cards we got to go. So I want you to package, Jordan. Make note. We're gonna throw four of these gift cards into random orders on any merchandise that comes in in the next ten minutes. Ben, Anything someone, that comes in before eleven o'clock. Someone's saying the spell search are out. Is that the just keep refreshing thing? the page? Yeah, okay. Refreshing. So we've got. You guys are overwhelming the website. You got to keep. You guys are crushing. Yeah, keep crushing the website too. We absolutely love that. So the super chats are insane right now. I'm going to give away something to some. All right. We got to wait a little bit because we just did another giveaway. We're gonna, I, I, I want to give away everything. Let's, should we answer some questions here? All right. Yeah, good question. 
All right, so your grandpa owned a cabinet shop in KC for decades. I got Brandon White got a couple questions coming. Brandon White, please don't spam. I see your question, boss. Don't spam. Cabinet shop, he retired and moved down to Northwest Arkansas where he lived and he and I do woodworking out of your garage shop. Introduce him to your videos and he loves it. I love that, Brandon, thank you. My grandfather and my wife's grandfather actually really enjoy our videos as well. And they also really appreciate my ridiculous self-deprecating and very dad-like humor, which is amazing. Would I would have never, like the dad jokes, I would have never have thought that. So uh, I love that, Brandon. Thank you. Um, did, did Matt character to update his server? <laughs> Matt, they're they're probably doing a phenomenal job down I'm there. Sure at bunker. Just on We're probably not even the hot. Matt's probably selling more T-shirts off of a bunker video or off of his uh, demolition video right now than than we are doing uh, this giveaway here. So we've got we also, we have two hundred fifty bucks. Um, in gift cards to go away. We've got one more saw, right? I think we've got one saw. One saw, chisels, a hand plane. Oh, all right, so coming back to some of yeah. these comments. Let's dive into So how do I, active. excuse me? I want to know about your oh, can you give me a name? Who's the name? Oh, it's <laughs> All right, so my tattoos. I have a bald eagle tearing out of my bicep because why the hell wouldn't I want that? And I got all my tattoos when I was playing football. And these are, it's only this half sleeve that I have here. Um, and I said, I bet a few of my buddies when I was in college, I said, I will get, if I play one snap in the NFL, I will get the most ridiculous tattoo I can think of. And we may have had a few libations when I made this bet, but we ended, I ended up with this tattoo and I love it. I think it's, I think it's awesome. Um, the reason I got it is because I played center so my arms out, you could see the eagle, which is amazing. And then I have the, the Galston flag, don't tread on me with, this, with the snake um, on the inside of my bicep. Uh, the Keller's held up pretty well. Probably should get those touched up. My wife doesn't really want me to get any more tattoos, um, but what she do doesn't know doesn't hurt her. I think she'll know. She'll probably know. She'll probably know. But I'm having a daughter, so I'm definitely going to get a, some daughter. You're tattoos. internet famous. She'll see it on you. I'm internet famous. I'm not even close to being internet famous. We're trying to get internet famous here. Do, 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 do. So what do you do to America every day? <clears throat> uh, to America every day, I mean, we wake up, we punch every day in the face, right? And, and live every moment like we're free. And we live every moment with gratitude and humility uh, to the best we can. So I appreciate that. My preferred brand of deep pour epoxy. All right, Tom Urbane, great question. Get a, send, a, send Tom a shop rack. Sign shop rack. Really appreciate that, Tom. Um, right now, my favorite brand of epoxy... <sighs> It's, it's tough. We're really liking this river table epoxies, but I'm really familiar with the flow cast from eco epoxy and their deep pour resins. So we're really liking that one a lot. Um, we actually just did a flow cast pour yesterday, two days ago yeah. that were given away to one of the veteran families in need. I'm um, here over the holidays and Ooh, excuse me. Bubbly, I don't think you can bubbly water. I mean, both are great. I don't think you could really go wrong with either. Yeah, both Rivertable. are really good. Uh, you, if you go to rivertables.com, you can get a 10% discount. Um, I think it's like Maleki 10. Go watch one of my, my latest video. This video actually. Um, for I the table. For we're the we're table we're giving away in an hour. Um, you can see it there. And uh, you can get the link and the discount there too. John, Brandon White wants to know what the massive chisel behind you is for. Ooh, Brandon. That's a great, gotcha. that's a good one. So this will take us into uh, kind of the- uh, Great one of the, segue. Huh? One, great of the segue. Thing, one of the things we wanted to talk about here, which was like, we had, all right, so I'm going to give a $25 gift card to someone who can name the two projects in one, in one message, two projects in the chat that we had the biggest mistakes on this year. They have to do with this, one of them has to do with these chisels. I should be doing homework, but John's way more important. I agree. <laughs> Do your homework. Kids. I agree. <laughs> Haven't used epoxy. There's a little bit of delay. Something about bacon. God, those squirrels. See some hunting and fishing videos. We're working on that. Flag above Ron. That's amazing. It was a Jennifer gift. Wall on the river table. Boom. That's, that's Boom. So that's there's better. our winner. Seth Pittman nailed it. The waterfall river table that dumped all over the floor and this timber frame wall. Can we just take a minute to talk about putting up that timber frame wall? Uh, the, this might have been the, the 
the most awesome and the worst project that we've ever done Sam, all at once. Sam My likes, back still hurts. He likes to call this a backyotomy. I think I need a new back after that one. If you guys haven't seen this video, we put up this, this wall behind us with the little timber frame accents because John and I are both very excited about timber framing and we figured the best way to start would be to try to do it inside where it barely fits. Correct. And neither of us are good at math. We got excited. Also we correct. hand cut joinery. We messed up joinery. We redid the what joinery. What giveaway are we on? And okay. it almost didn't fit. And then, what, do we have that mallet here? The oh mallet, yeah. That mallet is like a superhero. I fully expected to break this thing in half and have it hit me in the face, but in that video, John turned this super terrible round, the grains all the wrong direction handle, and we beat this thing into submission. And John's up on a ladder with his back, holding the whole thing together, yes. screaming. I'm on the ground, we're swearing at each other. It was a good time. But that's gonna have to go down as one of the, the fails of the year. Yeah. As far as Well, I wouldn't say just, fail. Cause it's, I mean, it looks great. Yeah, who thinks, who thinks this looks great? It's who thinks just, this looks great? Because I think it looks great. But with that... It's one of the funniest moments for sure. Yeah. I mean, I laugh every time I turn that video on and you see that you have uh, me on a ladder screaming at Sam and then Sam just coming in and wailing, wailing on this thing to Swing get it up away. there and into place. So, uh, Should we talk about... Yeah, absolutely insane. So back to coming back to this... That's what these chisels are for. So this is actually called a timber frame slick. It's about three and a half inches wide. Uh, it's an awesome, an awesome tool if you're doing timber framing. You like pretty much have to have one um, in order to get things flat. Because between that and then block planes and stuff, which you have four minutes to snag up. Which item are we doing? Uh, low angle. Yeah, four minutes to win one of these yeah. if you purchase stealth the stealth shirt on the website. Um, <clears throat> someone randomly is just going to show up with your order, by the way. Uh, you need this slick, and then these big chisels are to help with all of the mortises and the joinery and stuff, too, because having those big chisels is, uh, is, is a massive benefit to huge timber, because it's, like, really hard to do big chisels. things with small stuff. Um, so you can see, like, let me grab you. This is the biggest chisel I own for um, regular woodworking, and then this is uh, one of the timber frame chisels. So you can see it's just much beefier, much bigger. They're both socket chisels. This is like my go-to, like kind of everything chisel. And then this is a, this is a big old, big old girl. And those are like those are razor sharp. And then look how big this thing is compared to the slick. I want to know what brand chisel you use. Uh, we use Wood River chisels and Lee Nielsen chisels. The same chisels that we are going to be giving away here in the next like 30 or 40 minutes. These um, are a six piece set. The timber frame chisels are bar chisels. Yeah, and the timber frame chisels are, As yes! I it, are available uh, I'm also excited. on Woodcraft's website, woodcraft.com. Um, and you can get these bar, these bar timber frame chisels. Uh, they're, they're insane. So I'm going to put these away now. All right. Before I them. So, my goodness, these sales are flying in on the website. We're over 250 products sold. You guys are absolutely amazing. Like, I cannot express enough. Oh, hold on a second. I just gotta take a second to breathe. Whew. All right, two minutes. So anybody, anybody that, anybody that grabs himself, yeah, this, the, the, the stealth shirt here, you've got two more minutes. Um, win yourself. There's a little bit of a delay, so we'll let that go slightly past. Um, and with that, Jim Blaskowitz hit us with another $125. My goodness, Jim, you are an angel. We need kid sized merch. We're on it. Did then write that down. <laughs> Kids merch. Oh, we already did this one. Yeah. All right. He asked for a signed hat. Sorry. But yeah, we need some kids merch. All right. The chisels are the planes. So I'll tell you how you can win the chisels when we get ready to give them away. Same thing we're kind of doing here. Um, the block plane, you have a couple minutes left, Wes. If you snag up one of the stealth shirts, um, we're going to throw it into a random box. With those shirts, you'll, it'll just kind of show up at your house, most likely, um, and you'll be awesome. I think, so. Jordan, did someone ask me about a smoker? I saw my name shoot by real quick. Uh, Jordan's having trouble reading. You never caught me out. Uh, no, I didn't. You're right. I forgot. I'm your dad. All right. 
All right, so favorite player that I played with in the NFL? This is a great question, Jordy. Thank you so much, Jordy, for that question. Let's throw Jordy a shop rags and a, and a set of glasses and a punch day in the face t-shirt. So Jordy, email ben at johnmalecki.com with your uh, shipping information. We'll get that stuff out to you. <clears throat> um, yeah, we're going to give it another two minutes to trickle in because of the delay. But anyway... So when I was in the NFL, I had the fortunate um, time to play for mostly the Steelers, but I played for the Browns, the Bucks, the Reds, the, not the Reds, the Washington football team, and uh, the Titans. I think you can um, call the Redskins. That's what they were. That's what they were, yeah. But, um, and the Steelers mostly. So I was with the Steelers when they had, you know, Troy Polamalu and Heinz Ward. Um, Big Ben was obviously still there. Brett Kiesel, James Harrison, a lot of, like, really, really, really good players. I would have to say my favorite player I've ever played with was probably Troy Polamalu. One, because he's a first ballot Hall of Famer, an absolutely incredible human. But two, when I started building, I donated a coffee table to his charity. I don't think um, I know this story. You don't. None of you guys know this story. Story time. Story time. And, uh, and so he invited me up to his, his charity benefit. And, um, and I'm sitting there. And the table comes up for auction. And they put it up for like 200 bucks. It was just this like, I took an old door and I think I put some legs on it and I burned it or something. And, uh, and it was a very basic beginner build for me. And Troy was like, I like that. And he was sitting next to his wife. And she was like, I like that. <laughs> they bid the table up to being like $1,800 for final bid against the two of them. There was a third person in there for a minute. Wait, him and his wife but him and, him and his wife other? were across the room bidding against each other for the table. Um, and I think they were aware, but just like such a cool moment, right? Like one of the people I idolized growing up watching the Steelers then went and like bid all this money for something I built in like one of the first years that I got started building. So uh, Troy was absolutely amazing. Brett Kiesel has also been a huge supporter um, current players, uh, Dave DeCastro, Marquise Pouncey are both still friends of mine. Both uh, really, really, really good football players. Sam doesn't know football very well, but those I dudes like are teams. monsters. Um, I got to play with, uh, on some other teams. If you guys remember Peyton Hillis, he was hilarious. I played, he was with the Browns when he had his like breakout season. Uh, funny story is I picked him up in the last pick of my fantasy football draft for that year. I ended up winning the league because no one knew who he was and he came on the scene and just absolutely exploded. Is that like um, insider trading if you're playing? <clears throat> no, I got cut. They cut me, so that oh, was their okay. fault. Then you're good. But uh, I'm seeing some people saying if if it says that it's sold out on the website, just keep refreshing. Keep refreshing it. You guys are overwhelming the overwhelming the system there. They shouldn't be sold out yet. Nothing should be sold out cuz ever ever. Nothing so, should okay. All right. So coming back to it, we've got, you know, we picked up another 20 orders. That is amazing. Uh for the hoodies and the stealth shirts. You guys are absolutely insane. Oh, these chats are coming through so fast. Okay, the chats are the chats are out of their mind. Jordan, I've got a... Uh, Did you get I'm, a Super Bowl ring when you were with the Steelers? No, I wasn't with the Steelers when they won a Super Bowl, unfortunately. Um, someone's knocking at the door here. I'm gonna, I'll go ahead <laughs> that. You keep the chat going. So, Jordan, I'm sending, you, I'm sending you the winner of the block plane. We did just pick a winner for the block plane. Thank you guys so much for everyone snagging up the stealth shirts. The next thing we're going to give away will be this number four block plane. Um, and I'll let you guys know when you can win that. Uh, boy, so we are 11.03, 57 minutes left. Can we talk about, uh, yeah, all right. So going back, what was it? Yeah, Phil, of course, neighbors need something. Um, so this, this super chat is, let's hop back into some of these super chats. So who wants to win some, who wants to win some stuff to super chatters? Do, do, do. Been grilling pizzas the past couple of months. Patrick, what kind of pizzas are you making? That's amazing, my friend. Uh, we love, I love doing pizza on the grill. It's, it's a lot of fun. You get yourself a good stone. Uh, it's amazing. Um, when Sam gets back, we'll dive into talking a little bit about the waterfall epoxy table that's still all over the floor behind us, um, which is great. Hey, shut up back there. God, people are so rude. Do they not know we're having this like epic live stream time to talk to my friends here on the internet? which has been amazing. Uh, so my first plane, I actually started out buying uh, used planes at garage sales and stuff. Um, and with those, I, uh, I, I finished them up. 
uh, excuse me, I like finished and buffed them up and made them use, uh, usable. So the biggest hurdle when I was switching careers, it was really tr uh, <clears throat> putting them, for me it was like not having a coach, right? So when you're playing football, you have someone telling you what to learn, telling you how to do it, telling you when to do it. Um, and you can learn easily because you have that resource there all the time. When you're not playing a sport, um, it doesn't really work that way. So like in that regard, you have to teach yourself. I think that was a huge thing for me. was like finding the right resources, finding the right places, um, and growing on my own terms and trying to become better in that regard. Uh, <clears throat> that was, that was one of the hurdles from switching from something that was such a high level like football. Okay. Order finally went through for Keith. That's amazing. Keith, thank you for your order. Somebody Keith. super chatted us for, I don't know what currency it is, but 1700 and something. What is that currency? HUF? I mean, it didn't go up that high over here. Oh, it didn't go up that, that high. That seems over to there. be like it's delayed. Does it? I think, I don't think it's super. Well, thank you, whoever sent us that $1,790 of HUF. Hungarian. Hungarian. <laughs> nice. That's amazing. I don't I'm, know. <laughs> no. Hungarian dolhares are, are, are awesome. First tool to buy. Okay, so there. you should sell the epoxy on the floor. Oh, that epoxy is so bad. <laughs> it's, it's still awful. on the floor. Sam, all right, so Casey Saylor asked about our favorite camera. Um, and what did we get started with? So I'll say we got started with a Canon T, uh, T3i. Oh yeah, I forgot. The I had that way back in like 2000. it's still in a drawer. It's in a drawer, it, it's broken. Um, way, 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 way back in the day. And then, um, then the ADD? And then, yeah, and then I upgraded to the ADD after I went to YouTube's Next Up. I used like their, they give you like 100, 100 bucks yeah. or something. And then I want to say that we were still using that when I jumped, when I joined the team in 2018, was that? Yeah. Yeah, we jumped up to the we were Sony. Using that. And then we, shortly after that, we got a Sony a7 III. Uh, we jumped up to full frame, we could shoot 4K, all that good yeah. stuff. And then we just recently, we were one of the first pre orders, I think, for the, the Sony, nope, the Canon R5. Yeah. Uh, the newest camera, mirrorless, full frame, shoots 8K, all that good stuff from Canon. And we've been loving that. So if you've been watching the videos for the last, mm, Ben, when did we get that? Maybe four months back? I was here. We got it when I was here, so only like two months. The Canon? Yeah. Yeah, like it last just came in. Last couple months, uh, if you noticed a huge jump in quality in the videos, that's why. It just came in. So like the Canon, yeah, the, the Canon's amazing. Um, Stealth orders are coming in, so if, if you're waiting, we're good. No, I, I picked one while you were. No, I mean, for them on the site. Oh, yeah. Oh, so if it says sold out, refresh. Stealth yeah. orders are coming in. Thank you guys out. so much. Um, favorite wood species to work with? I really like working with um, with walnut, but I also, like, my preferred wood is definitely white oak. It's, it's white oak. Everything John makes is white oak. If it's for his house, we're using white oak. So what do I make and sell, Chandra asks, that's not on YouTube? Pretty much don't make anything that I don't that I don't it's, put on YouTube anymore because we, we focus a lot on getting you guys as much content as possible. Um, so like that's, that's been a focus for I ours. I think that table that we did for under that window was the last thing that wasn't a YouTube video. Nice. So Nico here got laid off from being a chef. I, I'm sorry to hear that, but got into woodworking and he's trading his shop skills for cooking skills because <laughs> he want to trade shop skills for his cooking skills. Um, yeah, follow up when we were not in the middle of a pandemic, and we'd love to have you come down here and teach us a thing or two about cooking. We try hard at cooking, but that, we have that'd be awesome. What we're doing. I want to thank some of the guys here in the super chats. All right. Du -du 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 -du. Okay. Do you think first one we can learn this one? Or do you like blueberry pancakes? JC, I'm going to have to go with the blueberry pancakes question. <laughs> uh, we're not going to talk economics on here. <laughs> Great question. But yeah, I actually prefer blueberry pancake to a chocolate chip pancake. Mm, if you were... I, I think I'd have to go chocolate chip. Yeah, I, I got a sweet tooth. What's up? What about banana? Banana. Get out of here with your banana pancakes, Jack Johnson. <laughs> yeah. Do you guys actually use the double-decker desk? We use Ohio yes. Power Tool with an amazing... All right. Make Ohio Power Tools been sending us all kinds of unbelievable amounts of money. I, I gotta ask, what this, why nineteen dollars and eighty three cents though? I've seen that come across a few times. Yeah. It might be the max he's allowed or something. Some so for some reason. Maybe that. Maybe. But um, send them uh, send Ohio Power Tools uh, two pairs of glasses uh, and two shirts. Ohio Power Tools shoot Ben at johnmalecki.com an email. Great question. Uh, the double decker desk we use literally every day. 
Uh, it's, it's been an amazing addition to our workflow, which has been really cool. Uh, cold deb, <clears throat> excuse me, cold devilic. Um, the hardest thing about starting my own business. Um, the hardest thing about starting business is balancing time, right? It's really easy to dive into one side of the business that you feel like is important and let the other side go. Really learning to managing your time is really difficult when it comes to business. And it's been one of the things with, as our team grows here too, that I put a lot of time and effort into making sure is going on. Mm -hmm. Um, because if you're a one man wrecking crew, if you're not focusing on sales, then sales aren't going to be coming in. If you're on the other side of it and you're working, working on putting out product, well, someone's got to go sell those. So balancing that time, mm -hmm. understand, like I hired a business coach, started doing some block scheduling stuff. Um, and, and that was really, really good to help me grow, learn and understand some stuff. Um, I, I think people glorify the like, oh, I can work for myself, make my own hours kind of thing. But like gotcha. the truth is that the hardest part of it is that there's no one to guide you. You don't have hours. You, the harder you work, the harder the business succeeds, right? Yeah, and so Mika, Mika H. asked a similar question, and I, th and I think we kind of answered it there. Mental hurdle. Uh, by the way, I'm giving away this block claim to uh, a random super chat here in the next, uh, let's say, 15 minutes. So one of, the, one of the super chats that come in, I'm going to throw you this block claim. 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Sorry, Ben's, Ben's, Ben's says running out of time. Um, but mental challenge when, when you're starting out is... Uh, is feeling like you're, you don't, you're not doing enough, right? It's like, that, that's something that happens to me a lot is I feel like if I'm not working, then something's wrong. Like I should be uh, doing something for the business at all times. <clears throat> if you get over that challenge and make sure that you're putting your like mental yourself, carve some time for you. Um, that's a, a big piece of advice in starting your business. Do, 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 do. Punch it in. The Andrew Tomkovich is wearing a punch today in the face shirt today. I love that. Thank you, Andrew. You are a rock star. Pennsylvania native here. Thank you, Will Bandy. You are absolutely amazing. We got another 3,490 huffs that just came in. Uh, <laughs> that's super awesome. Uh, DIY woodworking needs a plane. Well, you just super chatted, so now you are entered to win. Appreciate that. Uh, why did I leave the NFL? I didn't. I got cut for the 13th time. Um, and, and after you get cut, you, you, I mean, if teams don't want you, you can't play. Hit the showers. <laughs> Preferred sharpening system for chisels. We like, I, I use a combination of both my Tormek and uh, hand sharpening jigs. Useful hand plates to use with a shooting board. You're going to want a, <clears throat> I like to use a uh, smoothing plane, a number four or a number five or that four and a half work really well. Product that you spray with your HVLP. We spray a lot. Michael Wood, great question. We spray a lot of um, two-part catalyzed lacquer. Now, granted, if you're going to spray lacquer, we have fans in our room. So the fans actually help to uh, make sure the air is being removed and stuff. Don't go spraying a bunch of toxic stuff in your garage. Uh, we also like to spray general finishes and Durovar. That, that lays really well. Those are our two favorites for sure. Yeah. So random. Uh, is cereal soup? I hate those questions. On to the next. Adam Hoover. <laughs> Any tips for people with very small shops? Think about storage vertically, right? If you need to use space, go up. A lot of people don't utilize anything above four feet on their wall. Mm -hmm. Just because something's up high doesn't mean that you can't use it. So that's my piece of advice for small shops. Also, multi-use things. Like yeah. our workbench also has um, a, a hub for like the shop vac storage, right? We can store all of our parts bins in there. Yeah. Use things with multi-function. If something only has one use in your shop, I would consider like figure out a way that you can either use it for more things or upgrade to a tool that you can use for multiple applications. For things sure. that are single use. Like a flip top, items. Brad's flip top stand yeah. or something like that. you can use that square footage for two things, or you're in way better way. For sure. shop's twice as big. Favorite Ron Swanson quote. Mine's going to be, I don't know if you heard me, but I said all the bacon. You're not going to go with never half-ass two things when you can whole-ass one thing? <laughs> I knew that was yours. <laughs> All right, when did I get started woodworking? Um, it was my, before my last season in the NFL, it was 2013. I picked it up as a hobby in the off season. Um, more lathe projects. I gotta learn to turn a little bit better. Um, if you watched the cooking video, I make a three foot long potato masher and I here? actually turned the handle. Someone, someone gotta find that. Another 1700 huffs. Man, it'd be so cool if those were like dollars. Those are just like astronomical amounts. Uh, favorite cordless tool brand and finish. Those are, okay. Favorite cordless tool brand. <clears throat> we'll go with like contractor tools is right now going to be DeWalt. DeWalt's often in a lot of versatility in their tool line. If not, Festool would be our favorite tool brand, I would think. They make cordless tools. And then our favorite finish is going to be uh, Endurovar by General Finishes.
Thank you, Harry. Demetrius Henry. Just became a father and daughter, Sophia. Congratulations, my hey, friend. Hey, congrats. Six month congratulations. Thank you for the congratulations to myself. We're hoping to be an amazing dad. If you haven't seen the video of me cooking Thanksgiving with the boys, um, I turned this, and this is a three foot long potato masher uh, that came in a lot of handy. You can, you can we made it. all the potatoes. Yeah, so you can hold that. Make sure that you check. All out. right, a couple more minutes for the super chats that keep coming in. Uh, how did Sam join the team? Story behind Sam. So if you go back to like the third video I ever made on YouTube, I built a table with our buddy Tim from Into the Dirt Shop. Tim and Sam went to high school together. Tim decided to change courses with his um, business while Sam was working for him. And so Sam was between jobs. We met up, I was like, hey, I'll take a leap here. You wanna build an empire of awesomeness? Sam uh, said here no, and then I drove to his house with cake, and then he came on the team. Nice. So stealth Those orders. Are all true. <laughs> yeah, stealth orders finally coming in. That's amazing. Uh, I'm super pumped. What NFL player was playing when you were that you didn't meet? Do you wish you did? All right, John. So a player that I wish I could have got to meet that was in the league at the same time I was would have been uh, JJ Watt. Uh, his brother TJ plays for the Steelers now. He's incredible. And JJ has done some amazing things for the community. Um, I went, Marquise Pouncey flew the entire O line to the Pro Bowl, but it was the year before I think JJ. I think JJ was actually hurt that year. Yes. <clears throat> so he wasn't there, but I got to meet a lot of unbelievable players at the Pro Bowl that year. It was a ton of fun. Um, some, of the, some of the best guys in the NFL for sure, because that's what the Pro Bowl is. Ben, I'm getting a lot of people saying they need a let us spray shirt. I know, we gotta make we gotta it. We're working, hey, 2021, we gotta keep their shirts yeah. coming. All right, so Michael Wood, we already answered that. Uh, cereal soup, don't like that question. We've got, oh, okay. Okay, okay. Christopher Gilbert, you are amazing. Love a plane even more. Okay, I like that. You're in it. You got a shot, my friend. Jim Delanio, thank you. All right, so we just answered that. These things, I wish they made it easier to like scroll through these a little bit. Ho, oh, things are moving. Canadian money. After the NFL or the other jobs, careers, I considered getting into sales with like a couple other companies, um, but I just figured if I was gonna take a leap of faith, why not do it then? And then I spent all my money on tools. <laughs> If you had joined the military, what branch would you have joined and what would you have wanted to do? This Ooh, is a really a tough question. question. Um, so I never read a book in my entire life for fun until I was living in a hotel my rookie year in the NFL for the summer. <clears throat> and uh, by the way, Chris, send Chris a gift card for, for that question and a pair of glasses. Chris Ellerby. Um, I read Lone Survivor for the first time and Lone Survivor actually kicked off my like love for reading one, but two, incredible admiration that I now have for the SEALs. So, I mean, I, I like to shoot for the moon. If I was to join, I would probably join the Navy and then try to become a SEAL. Um, and then I went on to read like, you know, Michael Murphy and a, and a bunch of other, a bunch of other guys that have served uh, <laughs> books and whatnot. And, and those are amazing. I just have such admiration for anyone in special forces. Um, I'm gigantic. And a lot of guys that are in the SEALs are also really big, like Marcus Luttrell is a massive human. Yeah, um, him and him Jocko's and his, gigantic. Jocko's pretty big too, so. Um, absolutely love that. Yeah, I don't think I'd be <clears> big <throat> enough for a seal. But yep. my friends do make fun of me because they say I'll buy anything that a seal is trying to sell. Yeah, exactly. So uh, I would have probably went that route. I don't know if I could have cut it, um, but you know, you got to dream big, right? All right, Christmas present for hubby who has who has chisels and saws and wants to move into epoxy work. Mm. Hmm. We'll buy him some epoxy. Get yeah. him, uh, get him one of the, like the total boat. Um, the epoxy, starter kits. The top epoxy starter kits. That'd be a great gift there, Sarah. Is there a tool you don't have in the shop but really want? Yes. I know exactly what you're going to say. There's a few. I want a wide belt sander. Yep. <laughs> I also want a double-sided planer. I'd like to have a 12-and-a-half-inch um, wide hand planer for if we ever do timber framing again, which yep. we plan on doing. Yep, I need one of those. Um, and those are three things at the top of my list. They're all... They're all thousands of dollars. Get out of here with your air conditioning. That's not a tool. Suff suffering is something uh, that we bigger plastic cutter. Here. That's a great, great question, designer. Joshua Hatcher, what's up? Uh, would I rather, Big Ben all day. Mahomes is amazing though. I'd rather block for Big Ben, because I'm a Yinzer. My favorite thing to build, right now we love making, uh, I just love making dining tables for some reason. Peace. Yeah. yeah we make Sherry just tables. bought a Yinz shirt. Thank you. Did you get one of the, weren't we supposed to do a drawing for the holiday shirts? Hmm? We were supposed to do a drawing for the holiday shirts. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 for sure. 
Sure. Yeah. All right. All right. We got one our, one more minute. Our... One more minute for the giveaway for the number four plane to these super chats. This is incredible. I can't believe how many people just want to win this thing. How do you come up with Miss, Miss Piggy. Piggy for the CNC? So, um, I tend to call large things Miss Piggy because like pig and oink and big and all yeah, that. Yeah, we call things a pig a lot. I call anything that's large for me. I, I call them. A, oh my goodness. No, that's a rub. <laughs> Two hundred rubs. Two hundred rubs. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> uh, George. Georgie, thank you. So Miss Piggy just kind of came to mind as being like, she's, it's a, it's a really big CNC. Do, 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 a, a quick release, for, good, good call there, Tom Urbane. Quick release spray would be really good. Anything from that like list of products I give in my epoxy tips and tricks video, like all that stuff would be, would be awesome. So, <clears throat> all right. You also have that video coming out, right? When does that come out? Can you get uh, Ben and John Malecki? Ben and John Malecki is the email if we told you guys to send one over. Um, just B E N kept that one super simple. Blake, tell your kids that we also say hi. 300, we're at 328 orders. These are scooting in. This is, we major. still have over a thousand people guys. watching. Too. We have a thousand people watching. We have 40 minutes left and we're, we're getting to some of the big ticket giveaways here soon. So the block plane. All right. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to blow up the chat and I'm just going to scroll through the super chats and then and randomly Jordan say stop randomly stop. Actually, where are they going? Ah, I lost oh, no. the screen. They all there? Yeah, wait, wait. Hold, hold on, guys. Hold on, guys. All right, Jordan, can you see all the? Can you get all the super chats filtered? Uh, Pop chat, maybe. No, I can only do that in Minecraft. Like, uh, okay. So I'm just gonna scroll. Yeah, we're getting exploded here. I'm just gonna scroll the screen and then stop on whatever super chats on the screen. We're picking that one. All right. Okay. Ready? Ready? Go for it. Round and round we stop. go. Nicholas DeJoe, yes, you just won a number four block plane. Congratulations, my friend, really appreciate it. Uh, he wants to know about the coffee on tap. And he wants to know about the coffee on tap. Uh, we, haven't, I haven't, we haven't been working at the house, so I don't have any coffee on tap, because it actually does go bad. So, oh, what have we got here, Ben? We got, 40, we got 40 minutes left in the, in, in, on the live here. Well, we might actually go a little longer if I'm feeling good. We've, we've got, if, if the people want me, we're gonna stay. Don't tell them. We're going to be here for the rest of our lives. I don't mind. I don't mind. I love this. I love this interaction. Yeah, this is, this is fun. Um, what else right. do we have to give away? So the number four plane. So what we got left to give away is I've got $200 in gift cards left. We've got the chisels, two outfits from Timberland Pro, gift cards, grills, a grill, and my table here. Um, so hit me up in the chat. I want to know who wants to win the table. How many of you came here for our table? Because we are, I'm not going to lie, Sam and I don't love this thing. It's got a lot of imperfections in it, and we would never sell it. <laughs> Man, you're really selling so, you're them up on this. But I kid you not, we've had it sitting in the front window of our office for about a, a month. Um, it's it been about a month. What day is it? <laughs> and uh, people literally stop in their tracks and look at that table. And we've had multiple people that are like, that is the coolest thing we've ever seen. I think Sam and I, we got to look at all these comments coming in. Oh, so many comments. Chris wants a table. All right, you guys, 40 more. We're, we're going to pick that around noon. I, I act, okay, people want the table. They want the table. Is anyone here for the grill? Anyone? Who wants the grill? Table or grill? I saw it. I saw a grill. I grill, saw a grill, musketeer. Grill, grill. Is that Casey Neistat? No. <laughs> Give it to my mine. brother. Yeah, like the, so the grill's sweet. So if you've watched any of our recent like shop chef content, uh, the grill has been the grills have been amazing. The grill has uh, the new grill that shop. we showed. Sorry, but these orders are flying in. All right, so what do we got here? <clears throat> so we've got the chisels coming up next. So we've got the um, uh, everything's marked down for the number four right there, Jordan. Beautiful. So we got a six piece set of chisels here. I know a lot of you guys love these things and have been really looking forward to the chisels because the chisel set is, is a hot, hot ticket item. Um, so you've got 15 minutes. No. Oh. No. Screw it. We're giving it away. Now. Okay. No, I'm going to, we got to give them a little bit of a lead time. Five minutes to buy a piece of merch, and then I'm going to pick out of anyone who's bought merch in the last five minutes. Ben's really to get these stuff chisels. Away to you guys. We got a lot of stuff to give away. No, we got we, we got, got plenty of stuff. All the stuff we've given away. 
Well, hang on. We got on. a lot more what? to the left. That's we do. Yeah. Hey, uh, we'll take the all right, Jordan, real quick, can you run up? Eh, no, nah, they're good. The Timberland Pro thing will be, be all right. Um, and then we've got, I want to give away a $50 gift card. So we've got to do something fun for a gift card. So let's do, um, hmm, what can, should we do like John, Mal John Malecki backs? Let's like, do a trivia question a Trivia here. question, like what's something that a hardcore John hardcore Malecki fan, fan would know? Hardcore fan would know. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> No. What was the video in which John injured his finger? Yes. All right, so $50 gift card to the first person who can tell me what video Tent did I potentially <laughs> have to go to the doctor's office because I broke something. No, it wasn't the patio. Oh, oh, oh. Home remodels? Yeah, but you got to be more specific. You got to be specific. We've done a bunch of home remodels. Yeah. Yep. That, yeah. Okay, we'll give yeah, it to we'll that one. Yeah, the home shelves. All right. Patrick Bruner, you, yeah. my friend. Congratulations. Boom. Really appreciate it. Coming out. Um, yeah, you can win twice today, John Finch. There's no rules. There's no rules here to my giveaways. <laughs> I'm just, just throwing things out there. So um, back to these uh, super chats. Man, you guys are amazing. Bought a house with a sick deck. You do need a grill. The Tillies need a grill. The, here's a good thing. We'll be working with Pit Boss in 2021 because uh, they are an absolutely amazing supporter of the channel. Um, we're probably gonna be doing a couple more giveaways. So if you don't win one today, be sure to subscribe so you can see what's going on with all the squirreliness down the line. All right, here for anything you can win. You need tools and want a grill. Also, <laughs> designer, I'm glad you like these ugly mugs here. Thank you, that compliment made me smile. All right, first project made me fall in love with woodworking. Um, <clears throat> for me, I built a coffee table, ironically, off of a Anna White plan. Oh, by the way, you know what? I'm doing 25% off our plans right now on the website. It's uh, BF25 is the code. I'm going to give away, what are we going to give away here? We've sold 50 things today. And where do, where do people find the plans? You can go, just go to johnmalecki.com forward slash plans. It's pinned at the top of the chat. I'm gonna give away another $50 gift card to someone who buys a plan in the next 15 minutes. So we've got four minutes left on the giveaway for the chisels. <clears throat> Two minutes. Ben's over here just making. <laughs> what are you like, watching the clock? Yeah, we'll, we'll ship to a lot. Well, it's because the, there's a delay on the screen and then a delay on my watch. And there's, the merch is available at Bunker Branding. The merch is up every. Just go to johnmalecki.com and, and click shop. It's all that's pinned at the top of the top of the chat, and you can snag up some merch. All right. Brad said, "What's up?" Brad's, Brad's here. in the chat. Fix this build out. What's up? Check him out. Give another angle. Where's the tight shots? So Brad wants to see. Just start. Brad hates movement on screen. Can so we just start. Just start spinning. High speed. Just start spinning around the screen so Brad can throw up. Because I know he was eating a lot of turkey yesterday. He, and washed it down with some dew. You know it. For sure. For sure. So we've got orders pouring in. Is your phone on fire yet? My phone is on fire. I picked it. Ben picked it. All right. So the chisels are going to Andrew P. For your purchase. Thank you so much, Andrew. I really hope you enjoy them. Uh, you are an absolute godsend, um, and I, I appreciate all the fans of the channel. You guys are making this so much fun today. This, is, uh, this has been amazing. Um, all right, so Timberland Pro Gear. Yeah, let's give away. Let's, we gotta, let's, let's hold off until I can get done with the plan giveaway. We'll do the Timberland Pro next, um, and then we got a $100 gift card that we're randomly going to th – we're going to throw a $100 gift card uh, from between 1130 and 12. We're gonna throw a $100 gift card in any order for merchandise, in a random order for merchandise. So just, if you're in there, you got a shot. And we'll keep giving away crazy stuff to you guys that can aren't I, buying merch. Can a girl win the Timberland Pro? A girl can win yes. the Timberland Pro, they do have. So the Timberland Pro giveaway is full head to toe. You'll get uh, an upper part, a lower part, and a pair of boots. Pants, so, a jacket, or a hoodie. Jacket, hoodie, boots. all kinds of stuff like that. Um, You're going to be looking good going away. You will be looking good. You'll be warm, and these things will last you absolutely forever. Man, the, the super chats. Let's, I think I answered all of them. Love you guys, but would love a plane even more. All right, Christopher. Are we out of planes? We are out of planes. Can we get more? Next time around. 
All right, the towel in front of me. You know what? You got it. Um, who was that? Yes, Dead Rise Woodcrafts. You can have this towel. Jordan, or Ben, give this to him, and then I'll sign that. I'll sign that for you, too. <clears throat> Two hundred for the signed fish mallet. I will mallet. pay you to take that mallet. That, that's, that's not enough okay. for that fish okay. mallet. That mallet's, <laughs> that mallet's like five hundred dollars in epoxy. Come that on. thing is a constant reminder of, of bad ideas. <laughs> uh, I hate. I like turtles. One amazing name, Ben. I, I think Ben or Sam are big fans of turtles. One of them brought that up one time. Love turtles. Um, and you want to make your own garage wood shop? What are the first tools and steps that should be? I do have a beginner. I have a video on beginner tool, tools for beginners. Yeah, you definitely are going to want to check that one out. Or something. Let's help make you name, name the shop tools. Sam, what kind <laughs> of beard oil do I use? Sam's been using... We've been using the, the Beard Club. Beard Club beard Friends oil. Friends of ours, they sent us some good stuff. We've been, been rocking that lately. Tom, Tom wants a coffee mug. We don't have coffee mugs, but we have koozies. You can snag one of those up on the website. Those are there. All right. Uh, I just want to meet you and shake your hand. Yeah, we've got hats on yeah, the website. You can get this hat in black. Um, that's actually it right now. <laughs> we should work on a new option. We should, for that. Yeah, we'll get you. We want to put. We're thinking about putting the squirrel on the hat, but we got more stuff coming in 2021. <clears throat> What's for lunch? I ate too much yesterday, so I'm not eating food today. <laughs> what about for us? <laughs> Jordan's hungry though. Jordan Jordan's wants. Jordan would eat Chick Fil A for every meal forever. All right, so we've got planned sales rolling in. Let's check in on that. Let's check in on them. Dude, this is absolutely insane. And don't forget, if you guys have questions for us, <clears throat> yeah. make sure you're asking them. You don't have to be super chat for us to answer them. We've got 50 orders since I said that on, on the website. <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah, you guys have 10 more minutes for planned sales. Uh, what was I saying we're giving away with the plans? No. Jacob wants to know if we listen to Rush. Of course. Who doesn't? Actually not a big fan of Rush. What? I gotta say, Rush. my you buddy Tank, who's dead, hated Rush. And because he hated Rush, I hate Rush. Do you guys do that? Do you like have a friend of yours that you just latch on to their beliefs blindly? <laughs> All right, so we've got some more Super Chats coming. All right, so we're gonna do the same thing with the Super Chats for the first Timberland Pro giveaway. So when those start to scoot in, um, just we're just gonna randomly pick someone. We will message you. Uh, for one of your super chats to give you the entire head to toe get up from Timberland Pro, the first one. Second one we'll pick here in a little bit. My goodness. Just moved to PA, welcome to the neighborhood. These orders are amazing. Man, these things are coming. We're almost at 400 pieces of merchandise order. That's absolutely incredible. People are stoked on the grill, the glasses, Timberland Pro. Yeah. Uh, what editing software do we use? We use the Adobe Creative Suite, Premiere, Photoshop, Lightroom, all that for all of the beautiful images. <laughs> Christopher Potter, this is. <laughs> I saw your saw and sought your attention. I hope you saw this awful message. That message is not awful. That message, I regret nothing. That message, is <laughs> that message is poetry, my friend. Thank you, Christopher. Uh, beanies. I'm not a big beanie guy. I don't like my head so big. Like Ben's yeah. wearing a beanie right now. My head's so big that like I just don't wear beanies. Ben, can we do beanies? I walked in one day and John goes, take that off and put a hat on. <laughs> <laughs> it's not as bad as the visors that Jordan tries to wear. All right, but. Steven, thank you. Steven just sent us 20 bucks for brewskis. We do like brewskis around here. We'll have to um, go right down to Brew Gentleman. We had to, room, we had to cancel our holiday party, so we might just sit in here and get drunk <laughs> at some point. Uh, who knows? All right, favorite thing? Yeah, you should get drunk live. Get drunk live. <laughs> <laughs> I could, I could teach the people how to shotgun beers. Who wants to see me? Who Here wants me to teach you how to shotgun a beer? No, go get a beer. You want a real beer? Yeah, I don't want to shotgun a bubbly water. That Can would we suck. Have a beer? Who, if we get enough comments that people want me to shotgun a beer, oh. I haven't eaten any food today, so this should be good. Oh jeez. And all we have are IPAs, I think. John, what's your favorite thing you ever smoked? Favorite, my favorite thing. I've ever, I love smoking ribs. I'm a big fan of smoking ribs because they're, there's so many ways to do it. Um, and they're very, very forgiving. So I really like to smoke ribs. I'm going to have to go with the turkey I smoked yesterday. It was the first time I'd ever done that. I did a terrible job documenting the end of it on Instagram. Started off great and then I got excited and hungry. So I failed you guys as far as sharing the rest of that. But it turned out amazing. It was perfect. The bacon on it was delicious. I'm going to probably eat that for lunch today. The bacon, smoked bacon's great. Oh, it's amazing. 
Um, when he gets back, Kyle McKeary just bought some plans and asked for glasses. You got it. See, that's what I'm talking about. Thank you for buying the plans. He wants someone else to win the gift card. You gotta card. make sure his eyes are safe. Yes. We've got five more minutes on the gift card from the plans. I'm gonna, I'm gonna scoot through there for the 50 bucks. 50 bucks. See, you buy like a $4 plan and win 50 bucks. Also, I get to pay for Jordan to be here for another week. <laughs> All right. Sue, do, 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 do. So Timberland Pros coming in. These super chats are absolutely amazing. Thank you, guys. <clears throat> yes. So we got Chris Charton in the house. Thank you, Chris, for the five bucks. Maintain your property. And that's not a bad read. John Freeman. How much property you got, John? Hardwood for years now. And the in and out of the days saw as a killer. That I'm sure. Tim. Who wants to <laughs> Look at all these. Oh, jeez. We got Sierra, Hazy. Are they all IPAs? Yeah. I ask them what they want. I gotta let one warm up a bit. My wife, founders. my wife really doesn't want me to shotgun a beer on camera. She just texted me. <laughs> <laughs> Hi Sarah, how are the dogs? Shotgun the beer, yes. <laughs> punch today in the face sweatshirt is sold out. Here on my way to support the hell out of your amazing hair. David, that punch today in the face in 3XL should come back up. If it's not back up by the end of the weekend, send ben at johnmalecki.com a message. If you're an email. On mobile too, if you have a laptop, mobile's yeah. kind of going funky. Mo everywhere. Mobile's mobile's getting crushed. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna let. Which one should we? The Sierra Nevada will probably be the easiest to shock. I'm gonna warm this thing up. We should sell Yetis. <laughs> Custom Yetis. I'm gonna put this. We going down here. We probably do that. All right, double shotgun. I'm not gonna double shotgun. Oh, that's so aggressive with IPAs. Table or, or grill, you baby. I'll, we're, we're, the grill's coming up soon. Turkey, How was your turkey, Sondoris? Almost Sondoris. Steeler Veteran Appreciation Day in September next year. Absolutely. We, I mean, uh, Alejandro Villanueva actually works pretty close with the IATW Foundation we work with. A uh, phenomenal person, and uh, you know, I, I'm I'm not a stealer of any importance, but anything we can do to get back to veterans, we're always doing. Freedom Plan bundle of glasses are sold out on Amazon. <laughs> yeah, Chris Greenwood. Mark his name down. He gets glasses. It might take a while to get the glasses. Because we bought them all up. <laughs> John owns them all. Because we bought them all up. <laughs> okay. We got to pop down. We got five People more on it. I'm shotgun beers with you. I'm, I'm warming beer. up the beer for the shotgun. No more tattoos. Blah, blah, blah. My wife, she's and like, I, I, I keep thinking it's because she's pregnant. I'm like, it's an emergency. It's not. <laughs> John's she's just telling me. And a half acres she's just telling me what I can't do. Six and a half acres is amazing. I'm jealous. Grill on a single tree. Grill for Russia. What kind of truck do you have? All right, Justin Nelsler. Your seven-year-old son wants a shirt or towel. He's gonna get both. Mark that down. Shoot a message to Ben at JohnMalecki.com. We'll get your son a. Uh, We'll get your son hooked up there. Dude, these super chats are Jordan, what did you say someone asked? Unbelievable. What kind of truck do you guys got? <clears throat> Sam actually just became a truck owner. Yay! 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 Sam bought himself. Well, you tell him. Tell yeah. people, Sam. I, I bought my first F-150. Uh, what Was that Monday I bought that? Monday. Monday. Yeah. So I'm only a week into truck ownership. It's got the V8. Sounds like freedom. It's amazing. And John's got... We're a Ford family around here. John's got the F-250. I do. I have a 250 Platinum, a 2016 250 Platinum. I went swinging way above my pay grade when I bought that. Um, but it's been a good truck. It's been great. It's been a good truck. I, I'm, I'm a big fan of it. It's going to get a break now because John's going to make me go to Lowe's every time. In I am, truck. for sure. For sure. So, <clears throat> you want to, on the, on the T-Pro? Yeah. For both of them? One for a Super Chat and one for a Merch Group. Gotcha. All so... Right. We're gonna do the same thing with the super chat that we did before for the merchandise. You have two more minutes for that, and then we're also just, you know what? We're randomly gonna give it, I'm randomly gonna give away, uh, we already, hold on a second. I gotta give this $50 away to someone who bought a plan, and then we gotta give away. Let me put that over here. So you well, I gotta, okay. Jordan's gonna. Yes to Chris, he asked if the, you won one, you email Ben. Yeah, you won your prize. Yeah, 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 yeah. If I said you won a prize and you gotta email Ben, just so we can get your contact info down there and your sizing for your son and get you guys some hats and stuff. My what goodness. CNC machine would you recommend? <clears throat> Avid. Avid CNC, the absolute best. Someone. Especially for like, if you're just getting started, cause you can grow the CNC with you, right? 
You can grow the CNC's length. You can keep the keep the yeah, gantry set, modular. but you can you can you can move it around, which is which is Congrats something that we really like. Twenty five hundred Sierra Denali. Man, Steve is uh, he's balling out there with the Denali. The Denali, that's a that's a big boy. Is it a diesel? That's a big boy truck there. Is it a diesel? My favorite coffee is, is black rifle coffee. We I, I like the <clears throat> I like the BB. Young I like black. the AK as well. Just black's got to be my favorite. 50 out today and you're smoking a pork belly. I love that. I love that now, Stan. Don't you shut up and do take my money. Shut. What, what did you say, Jordan? Someone said now you can run the stairs and run that stuff. Gotcha. We're almost at 400 products sold on the website. So like I said, um, what did we, anyone who purchases by the end can win the Timberland Pro, the whole prize pack, and we're giving one away to the Super Chat here too. So... You've got one more minute to bring in Super Chats. I'm Sean really bad at this time. Don't shut up and take my money. Yes, $2. love Sean. Sean After we choose that, I will gun this beer in celebration. And before we do that, let's pick someone who snagged up a plan. Someone wants to know what our Chick-fil-A orders are. I, get, I just get a mountain of nuggets when I get Chick-fil-A. You get like the catering tray for yourself? All right, so the $50... <laughs> the the, the 50 bucks is going to show up... Actually... Those are digital plans. So it can't show up with what you ordered. <laughs> <laughs> that would be weird. That would be weird. But I'm going right now and pow. You got to be kidding me. His name's Jesus. Jesus Ali. I think it's Jesus. Might be Jesus. Could I, be. There's, no, uh, there's no things there. Can you, can you send that to me? Yeah, I'm sending it to you right now. Congratulations. You just won yourself a gift card. He's in... Somebody asked, sheets or gecko? Sheets all day long. All day. All day. Thank you for. Wow, that was amazing. I'm sorry, I'm sorry I gotta make I'm sure we're getting all this stuff. <laughs> Did you get that, Jordan? All right, perfect. So now, on to the super chats. Yeah. This is for full top to bottom Timberland Pro. Do I need? I need prescription safety glasses, Connor. Yes. Me I'm, too. Squ I'm squinting because. I wear, I'm like, do you guys know Elton John didn't actually need glasses till he started wearing glasses because he thought they looked cool? And then his eyes adjusted adjusted to the crappy glasses? Yeah, that's kind of what's happening to me. Started wearing them for safety. And now that I'm so safe, I can't see. So anyway, we're on a scroll. I got to go up and down a couple times. Do, 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 do. And pow. Oh, no one's there. <laughs> and pow. Pow. We're going to, I love it. Wes, we need more information, but if your name is W-E-S-S. -S, and you super chatted for $2. You just won the Timberland Pro, uh, top to bottom. Thank you so much. Thank you all for the super chat. We are getting quite close to the $100 gift card. Shotgun and a beer. We've got the Pit Boss Grill. We still got another Timberland Pro. Another, another, Timberland, Timberland, Pro. Pro. another Timberland Pro. That's going to go to, that we're going to randomly pick that person in the merchandise sales app. Uh, when we get to the end. Um, <clears throat> Sam wants a shotgun. All right, I so I do not my wife said no shotguns. <laughs> She's watching. You got to go through proper form, It's Friday. Right? So, sure by okay. the way, you guys saw nothing exploded out of this. This is a Sierra Nevada Pale Ale. <clears throat> I'm glad I'm going to keep... slide over this way a little bit. Hold we on want to get it up close and personal on this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Let me pierce that open. Nothing got anywhere. Why? Because this I'm a veteran. Look this, right down this camera. This is gonna taste terrible. <laughs> hide, your here, here, here. hide your children's eyes. You ready? Should we get anyone want to stopwatch this? Uh Sam, yeah, yeah. I don't have my phone on me. I'll get it. Uh, <laughs> Alright, whatever you're ready. Alright. Three, two, one, go. Boom! <laughs> Black Friday shotguns, let's go. 3.16. Someone Jordan said, said just, just the tip, shotgun the beer. Jordan said 3.16 on that shotgun. I've done a few of those in my day. Don't try that one at home, people. Uh, I just got beer on everything. All right. It should be done with the Natty Ice. Yeah, all we've got are IPAs. <laughs> I'm going to have to eat lunch after that one. I promise, Sarah, that's the only beer I'm going to have to eat. Savage. <laughs> If you guys could chat apologies to my wife, um, that would be amazing because I, 
I don't think I'm gonna be able to apologize. Don is squirrel powered. It looks like. Yeah, <laughs> Don is squirrel powered. That's amazing. Should we we should get squirrel powered patches. I wanna. Yeah. Next T-shirt. It's a squirrel that looks like Super Mario, and we'll say squirrel powered. <laughs> I like squirrel powered. I like squirrel powered. Squirrel yeah, power. Yeah, squirrel that down. Good. I'm sorry, dear. <laughs> Sarah, I see the people are. The people wanted it. They are sorry for you. Look on merch. Sorry, Sarah. Sorry, Sarah. <laughs> sorry, right. John's wife. So we're almost at 400. <laughs> we're almost sorry, at, Mrs. Malik. <laughs> we're almost you at four, 400 pieces of merchandise 